I started smoking at the age of nine. Well, in my job, it's a noisy environment. In the end, I couldn't shout. So I decided to go to the doctor and they sent me for tests and I got diagnosed. It was my 52nd birthday. Well, initially, when they told me, I, I felt a bit numb. I knew about lung cancer, but I had no idea what was happening to my throat. Well, immediately, you, you know that if it's the cigarettes, you know you know what's caused it, and you think, well, why did I do it? Basically, um, they told me that if I wanted to live, I had to have the operation. They took away my voice box, my vocal cords. I had a full necktie section. And I was in hospital for nearly three weeks. Terrible. The storm, uh, well, takes a bit of getting used to because you've got to learn to talk again. And, and in order to talk, you've got to stop breathing, if that makes any sense. Before I had this, I'd run up the stairs. Well, I can't do normal things like I used to do before, like walk a distance. I have to be supervised if I go in the bath or the shower. Well, if I get any water in that, I'm drowned. The people are not being funny, but I enjoy the smoke. And you don't think what it's done to you. I should have took notice when my dad and my brothers died of lung cancer. Listen to me. Don't let smoke and ruin your life.